if you were going to do this this film, what would you do? What would be the first thing that you did? And I said, I'd have a scout out from tomorrow night looking for the the right architecture, the right locations. Um, he said, OK, can you come down and meet everybody? Um, and so I sent the scout out and got in the car and drove to London. And by the following week, we realised that we had actually quite a fantastic uh, bunch of options for, for locations of Moscow and London. So um, it was incredible. 1980s is uh, is such a fond memory for for those that are middle aged. It's also it's also very trendy right now. Um, it's becoming trendier, and I can I watch the youngsters on the set, the trainees and the the younger uh, members of the departments kind of look longingly at some of the costumes that are appearing on the set. It's, they want to wear them so. So I think we've uh, we've tuned into a really uh, interesting time. I have been working with John Baird um, on and off for a few years now. We have been developing an, a, a script together and we've done lots of uh, research and location work on that, casting. Um, and uh, But I hadn't seen him in action until we started working on Tetris together. And uh, I've actually, I've found him really delightful and somebody should uh, bottle the energy that, that he has. It's, uh, it's relentless, it's amazing. He's, um, he's, he's really determined in a good way. He's incredibly decisive, which I love in directors. Uh, just makes a decision and moves on. Um, and also... I'm never scared to give him bad news because sometimes with, you know, you got to give bad news on a very regular basis to directors and, and some of them can handle it, some of them can't. John takes it all in a stride. Um, he's, he's, he genuinely is interested in, in uh, people, their motivation, their psychology. And, and I think that makes actors warm to him. He's, he has a control of the set that I I rarely experience. Um, and on top of that, he's meticulous. He does his homework and never drops a ball. <laughs>